Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are on episode 56 of the Pirate 101 Privateer walkthrough. I have already recorded the first clip of me saying that and I have my mic muted so I'm smart. Um, but today <laughs> we are back. Last time, if you haven't checked it out already, we um, did a whole bunch of instances and... Well, not actually, that was the time before. We went to the Isle of Fetch and found out that the um, cougars or whatever they are over there need um, terrible food. So that's what we're doing today. Um, I have just defeated a whole bunch of Sky um, Skygars, which are not cool. I don't like fighting them. They aren't fun. Um, and now we need to find some uh, prunes, apparently. Um... So yeah, that's basically what you're doing. You didn't miss much because it's literally just been talking to people. We went to the cannery to talk to the guy at the cannery and he's like, Hey, go and talk to a whole bunch of people and they will give you what you need. Except, just kidding, you need to defeat Skygars and you need six fins from them and they took forever. Literally an hour trying to get them. It was ridiculous. Um, ooh, level up. Nice. Was not expecting that. Um, prunes? We need some prunes. So yeah, let's go and get some prunes. We're also going to get the side quest for later. Um, so that's fun. Um, we will also, while we're here, we will level up our favorite three companions so far. Um, we're not going to level up you. We will level up you. And we will level up you because we can. Um, lots of levels. All the levels. We're level 56, which is pretty cool. 56, never thought I'd get that far. Um, just kidding, I did. Um, yeah, not too many levels to go, which is dope. And now we need to defeat cat smuggler ships for prunes. So, again, I will be back, or not again, but I will be back once I've defeated a whole bunch of these guys. Okie dokie, I am back. That took a long time. Um, luckily the ships weren't too terribly difficult, which is good. Um, but just... My, my hands are a bit hurt after spamming 1, 2, 3, and 4 for a wee while, but hey, it's fine. Um, so yeah, now we need yeast, so we're going on the yeast hunt. Um, yeast is such a weird word, don't like it, so we're going to not say that. Um, but yeah, we need to get the rising agent, also known as um, the, the Y word, um, which is apparently in this wee little, wee little place, Piggity's Sundries. I wonder who's in here. Oh, look, it's Mrs. Piggity. Who would have thought? <laughs> um, ooh, 3,000 XP. Nice. Two quests done today. That's not too bad. That is not too bad because these quests in Pirate are so long. Like, really, really long. Um, so, we need to go and do a whole bunch of dungeony stuff now to get yeast. Um, because that's what we need now. Um, so, yeah, let's head down to that place, which we can just go down here, because it is at the docks, so we're going to assume that means down here, hopefully, maybe, maybe, <laughs> right, yeah, 198, that's not too bad, right, um, hopefully we should be fine, there is a couple of bosses, um, I do know that for sure, I think it's this one, yes it is this one, let's go in here, enter now, see who's in here, we have a couple of fights, a couple of fighty fighties, um, but we should be fine, I would say. Yeah, I think we should be fine, probably, most likely, maybe, who knows, we'll find out eventually, won't we? Um, new quest, ah, this one. I remember this, I remember this now, Billy Whiskers, not a friend of mine, I don't like him, he is kind of difficult. Um, but yeah, let's go for a artillery right on them. Just drop it right there. We're going to move you up. We're going to place a landmine, like, right there, because they have to come through there eventually. We are also... I don't think they have that much movement, so we're just going to move El Toro up just slightly. Um, we'll go for his buff next round, um, because it is only five rounds, so gotta got to just use it wisely, considering that they're probably not going to get too close to us this time. They will take some damage through this. Thank you. Epic hit is even better really really good um so yeah they don't have that much range i didn't think they did but sometimes you just never know at least those three are all in line for a bomb dropping which we can do 198 not too bad could be worse 
Um, we can't get anybody. They're still out of range. So we're going to move Bonnie, like, right up. She has a huge radius. We're going to move her up there. Um, we're going to also bring you up there. And El Toro, we're going to give the accuracy and dodge buff now. Just because I think that'll probably be the best option here. Um, just to make sure that we're getting some accuracy and dodge before they come and hit us. So hopefully people can dodge. But is that going to actually happen? No. Because that would never happen. But hey, you never know. You never know. They're not even running. I am kind of upset. But here's the overwatch that we wanted, which is good. Um, just one. No burst fire or, or double tap. Um, so no crit, obviously. Burst fire, nice. Just use all up the burst fires. All of the burst fires, use them up. Good, 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 good. Okie dokie, can we get, um, do, 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 we'll do crit, I guess, sounds okay. We'll do this. Um, yeah. Let's go for, does he have vengeance? No, he doesn't. He does have bladestorm. Let's just go on this guy. I think that's probably the best. Just target this guy for a bit. We'll completely avoid that last guy that's just down this way a bit. Um, so yeah, mega hit, nice. That's really good. Half health for one of them. Minus um, dodge as well, so they shouldn't be dodging me. Um, if they were, if they did, I'd be mad. Um, Gracie's done a lot of work, actually, um, in the last couple of battles. She did die, but luckily, um, at the moment, as I'm recording this, it's um, uh, free Miracle Mitch services, so I just went and healed her up. Um, nice, look at that one. Nearly down. Nearly down. So close. Um, okay, immobilized attack. No dodge, because... You know, that's fun. Vengeance, nice. Relentless, blocked, nice. I'm not too worried about Gracie getting hit. Um, because she does have vengeance. El Toro, however, he is slightly not not okay doing that. Because his dodge can sometimes fail me a lot. But he's actually doing really well today. So I'm proud of him. I'm proud of him. He's doing well. I've also always thought that Gracie Conrad's really creepy. Um, and I finally figured that out. She doesn't blink. Like, she actually doesn't blink. Like, Bonnie Ann, she blinks. Gracie does not blink. Um, so yeah. Ooh, hello. That's not cool. Zero out of ten. Not, not again. No. No. <laughs> this is where my agility comes in, which I have none of. Because we don't get no agility. Um, burst fire. Oof, the dodge, unlucky. Epic hit, nice. This is where Gracie's will comes in handy. Because she's not an agility person, where everybody else is basically either agility or strength. And, yeah. But not today. Doesn't matter. Um, okie dokie. Wow. Um, yep, that's fine. Just hit Bonnie. It's okay. She won't be too badly hurt. Um, with this, we are gonna go for a... I don't really want to absorb. But I kind of do at the same time. Nobody's really down. So we're just going to hit, I guess, is probably the best idea. We're just going to destroy this guy first real quick with my companions. I'll slowly take this guy out. Unfortunately, he blocked. Unlucky. Kind of bound to happen, really. Um, burst fire was good. Epic hit. Gracie just coming in clutch here with the epics. Crazy, crazy stuff. Because she also blade storms as well, which is good. And hopefully, El Toro can not relentless. Because who would want him to relentless? Yeah, that's right. You get cheap shotted, boy. And relentless, yes. Yes, that is right. Overwatch. Yeah, you're bad, mate. You, you, mate, you're bad. Block? No, okay, that's fine. Bonnie would never block, but hey. Block? Yes, dodge. Nice. And repost. Easy clap. One down. One more to go. One more to go, or in fact, three down, one more to go, because that's how it works. Um, We're going to quickly go for this, because we can, and we're just going to go like that. Hopefully, this should take him out next round. Um, I will heal myself. Probably is the best option next. Um, just so I'm not dying for the next battle. Because I only have a few potions and stuff. So, yeah, we'll see. Okay. Not the best. Okay. Blocked is fine. I don't really mind if Gracie blocks. Um, we will heal ourselves. Because we have so many heals in hand. Boom. We'll do that. If I'm basically full health, I'll just go straight for a... Um, a hit on him next, but we will see. I don't think I will be, but you never know, and he might be dead anyway. No, 
Probably not. But you never know. Hit El Toro, do it. You won't. Okay. I was expecting him to block, but that's fine. <laughs> that's fine, I guess. Um, let's just heal again. We'll do a team heal this time. Just because we don't need too much health. Um, you can go there. You can just go there as well. Done. Hopefully this should kill, maybe, this time. Mega heal. Nice. Always good to get those crit heals. Um, and Kapu and Kapow. You are gone. Goodbye, Johnny Cheese. GG, we did it. Nice work. Easy peasy. Not too difficult. Seemed a lot harder on my musketeer. But hey, sometimes it just be like that. Or maybe it was the next fight. I don't really know. We will find out later, I guess. Uh, because what's next? Oh, look, more. Um, these are just a normal mob fight, so I will be skipping this. Um, so yeah, I'll be back once I've defeated these guys. Okay, I am back. And we have to go in the sewers because, you know, it's Marleybone. What would it be without sewers? Obviously. Um, so yeah, let's head into the sewers once again because that's where we always end up. Um, and we have to defeat more of them because why not? Um, so yeah, I'll be back once I've defeat um, these guys. Okie dokie, I am back. Let's go and explore the hideout because, of course... This is a sketchy place, and I don't like using a mountain there. <laughs> don't like that. That is very sketchy. Um, but yeah, let's head into the lair of Lafitte. Um, we're going to actually just potion up real quick because, haha, <laughs> yeah, we could be in trouble. Who knows, though? Haha. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Hopefully, this isn't too bad. I hope not. Um, but yeah, in the sewers, of course, because where else would we be? Ha <laughs> ha. Um, and what do we got here? Jimmy Socks. Okay, no dialogue, so I will not be doing this battle on camera. I will be skipping this because I assume the boss is next. Um, yeah, he's not a boss, so I'll be back in just a bit. Okay, I am back. We defeated these guys, and we gotta go to the next place, which is down here. I tried to heal up a bit during the last wee bits of that battle. Um, nobody died, which was good. So, hopefully we're not too bad health-wise. We're decent, so we shouldn't be too... Shouldn't be too difficult, the next boss fight, is what I'm trying to say. Because I know this is definitely a boss fight, and he's probably... Yep, he's orange. That's not good. Um... So, yeah, he is quite a... Quite a boy. Quite a boyo. So, we're just going to do normal team. Should be fine. We just need to defeat him. So pretty simple, really. And he is just so you don't, so you know that guy. He has um, a pirate cheap shot three, a blade storm, first strike two. I don't know why they give these guys pirate because he's literally not going to use it at all. So um, you know, it's a, I have no clue, but it's fine. We'll just um, deal with it. You can go there, Bonnie. You can go there. I'm trying to predict his path with those. It's, it's kind of fun trying to predict them path. Um, see where I think they would go. Um, but hey, there we go. He's got a bit of damage. We're already doing well. So basically, what we're going to do is just focus on him. Every single hit that we do will be on that one guy. Um, I don't know what he what his cheats are if he does cheat. Um, so we'll find out soon, won't we? That is definitely a yes from me. Um, gotta get, oh, okay, that's not cool at all. Hmm, yeah, we might have to play this a bit differently then, because if that happens every single round, I'm gonna be mad. Because that does a lot of damage, and I'm not a fan of that. What we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to charge him. I didn't want to charge him, but hey. Okay, we can't even do that. Um, we'll do that. You can just compute. You can't even compute them. Um, I don't want to hit these guys though, because it's just such a waste. Oh, he reduces our movement. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do that. You can barely go anywhere, and you can just hit him because that's fun. <laughs> we can barely go anywhere. That's why I couldn't go all the way over to him because he reduced our movement. That makes sense now. Um, 
But yeah, I mean, the more of these we take out, the less damage they can do, so it's not really, like, a bad thing. I don't want it to happen, but hey, I'm not going to complain about it either. Um, he's moving this time. Okay, that's not too bad. So maybe it's just the first time. That's fine. We should be okay. I say we will be okay. Block, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Repost, nice. The more, the more of these guys we can get, I don't need to kill them, but, you know, it's just makes my job easier. Don't have to get a whole bunch of damage taken. Um, attack. Yep, attack me. Do it. you won't. Do it. you won't. Okay, he did. They both did. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, spaghetti -o. Unfortunately, that guy did not die. But hey, we can now actually just destroy this guy. Pummel. Absolutely pummel. I'm going to go into Invis and do a super secret big, big hit on him. Um, we're still out of movement, so you can't actually do much. You can do that. Gracie... <laughs> I'm sorry, Grace. Can you go anywhere else? You can go there. Actually, Gracie can't even go there, so it's fine. We'll just do that. <laughs> oh, reduced movement is so bad. I forgot how tr trash it is to have reduced movement. Ugh, I hate it so much. I hate it. I hate it. But whatever, it's fine. One down. Which is a good start. First strike, block, please. Thank you so much. Attack. Yes, thank you, big boy. First strike. Relentless. He blocked. Okay, it's fine. He doesn't have repost. If he had repost, I would have been mad. Hey, at least he's coming closer to Gracie. Which is good. Attack. Blocked. Even better. His accuracy is pretty trash. No! Cheap shot kills me sometimes. I hate cheap shot. It's such a trash thing. Especially when you go in viz. And then it's like, no. I don't want to use the double damage on a stupid cheap shot. But hey, whatever. We did some damage, I guess. I'll just do a big boy hit on him without the double damage. Whatever. Ugh. Don't you hate it? I do. Um, mega hit, really good. Let's hope that with all of us hitting this guy this time, um, we will be able to do something good. Okay, we can actually do that. You can do that. You are going to come around here to do that. And you can just do that. Hopefully, this should be good. We will see. Repel borders. Uh-oh. That was not good. That was a lot of damage. Yikes. He, he. Oof. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Yikes is all I can say to that one. Um, I don't think I've ever really been speechless before, but whoo, that came out of nowhere. <laughs> I did not expect that to happen. <laughs> oh, that's my lack of agility again coming through. I love it. Well, Grazy, you did well. Good job. GG. Not too bad. So, despite me nearly dying, nearly. Not, I didn't though, so it's fine, but nearly. Whew. So yeah, let's get the extract. Um, nope, not that way. This way. This one here. There. Boom. There's the extract. And we go to go back to the tannery. So we'll just go back to Sundrise. And I think that'll be the end of the episode. Because, yeah, that's basically all the time I have to record today. Um, because I've been recording for like two hours now. <laughs> we also got a badge. I don't know which badge it was, but we did get a badge. Um, Le Chat Noir. The Black Cat. If you don't know French, it is the black cat. That's actually a pretty cool badge. I might have that on by the start of the next episode. Who knows? Um, in fact, can we find it real quick? Can I find it before we get into there? Um, it'll be... Let's give us five seconds. Quest badges. And we'll go right to the back. Um, they're not in any order, which is so frustrating. Okay, we can't find it. We gave ourselves 20 seconds. We couldn't find it. So, let's just head in, and I will find it between next episode and this one. I really wish they were at least in alphabetical order, because I don't understand the system of how they're sorted. It just seems random. But there we go! We get level 57, two levels in one episode. That is unforeseen. And we also get a companion. Holy moly. That's pretty cool. I did not expect to get a companion this soon. But yeah, two levels in one episode. Crazy stuff. I... 
don't know if the other level was cut out, but um, because I was muted, I don't think it was, but it could have been for all I know. Um, there we go, those are all level 54 along with Gracie Conrad. Um, so that's cool. Anyway, we're going to move away from there because it's really loud. I will catch you all next time. Thank you for watching. Remember to hit like and subscribe. If you're resubscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.